What's going on gamers? It's Roll Easy here and I'm back today on a Saturday morning with a gift cards to friends glitch for you. Guys, it's it's these glitches always seem like a lot of steps, but I'm telling you, once you get it down and you do it a few times, it is very, very simple. So what you're gonna need for this glitch is you need two friends and you all need to be in an invite only session and nobody can be registered as a VIP, an MC president, or a CEO. You wanna make sure everybody signed out of everything. That's super important, all right? So once again, two friends, invite only session, nobody can sign in as uh, nobody can be signed in as anything. It's better if you guys all have the same bunker. If you don't, it still works, but it's a lot easier with the same bunker. And uh, all three need an MOC with the personal vehicle storage. All right, so we're gonna do the car receiver's point of view. Uh, that person needs a Fagio or an LG in their MOC. Uh, friend one, that's the person giving the car. And friend two, that's the person getting guns in the bunker. All right, so we're gonna get started very soon and then we're gonna show you guys how to do this glitch. So, here we go. This is the perspective of friend one, the uh, guy giving the car, all right? You wanna park your car that you're giving basically right right around where you see mine. I'm blocking the passenger door with the wall and I'm blocking the driver's side door with the caddy. You want it right there and as you can see, you're gonna be able to teleport into the car when you hit Y. So test it out by going to the blue circle right here and hit Y right before it and you see you should teleport right in there. That's what you wanna see, all right? And shout out to my boy BMX and police for helping me out with this glitch. And uh, yeah, so you wanna just keep doing this. Name of the game is to run into the blue circle and hit Y. Don't spam it, you don't need to spam it. You just gotta get your timing right and hit Y. All right, that's triangle on PlayStation. This is on Xbox, guys. Xbox steps are a little bit different, all right? So here we go, here's a success. You wanna see it for a split second. So run, hit Y, and then you saw that, I put it in slow motion. He spawned in the car. And then right away, I was able to actually uh, go into the black screen. So you want to just see yourself in the car for a split second, and then now you end up in the MOC. That's how you know you hit it. Now, BMX was in the, my bunker. I'm going to tell him to leave. You don't want any friends in any bunkers right now uh, before you leave the MOC. That's very important as well. So tell everybody, get out of the bunkers. You know, everybody go outside. All right. Once everybody's outside, now you're free to actually leave your MOC. Okay, but that's really important. Tell everyone that they cannot be in a bunker. All right, so uh, yeah, at this point now, you wanna go ahead and tell the person receiving a car, you know, the car receiver, you wanna tell them to go ahead and join or jump into a Titan of a job. You see, that's what just happened right there. He jumped into a Titan of a job. I declined that alert. That's the automatic alerts we get on Xbox. Just decline that. Now, as the car giver, you can go ahead and walk out of your MOC. All right, once you walked out of your MOC, there's a few things you gotta do. Easy steps, but there's a few things. So, your friend, the car receiver, is in a job, all right? That's uh, BMX right here at this point. So, he's waiting in a job right here, um, and basically, well, doesn't matter who it is, really, just the car receiver has to be in a job. Now I'm gonna go ahead and join that person in a job. I'm gonna go to online, gonna go to players, and I'm gonna go ahead, I think it's police right now, yeah, that's in a job. So I'm gonna go ahead and join game on him. So just go ahead and span through the alerts. You should get that one. The session you're trying to join is private. It's either gonna bring you up to the clouds or it's gonna just do what it did right there. Either one is good. So now you wanna walk out of your bunker. This is really important. You must do this, okay? So I walked out of my bunker. Now I'm gonna proceed to just go ahead and walk back in. Now, when you walk back into your bunker, you're gonna be introduced to a infinite loading screen. All right, once you're in this infinite loading screen, the car receiver, he's still in the job. All right, car receiver guy is still sitting in that job right now because you need him once again right here. So right now, there's another person in the job here waiting for me. Police jumped into a job. <clears throat> Excuse me, he jumped into a job. Now, once he's in that job, I'm gonna go ahead and join him through the dashboard. All right, once I join him through the dashboard on Xbox, uh, we actually have to tell him to back out of the job once we're at the alert. PlayStation, you guys can just join all the way through. But yeah, so I'm at the alert. I'm telling police, go ahead and back out of the job. He told me he backed out. Now I'm free to accept the alerts. All right. Once I accept the alerts, you're going to get the same result that you did inside the bunker. It's going to say the session, uh, well, it's going to say unable to connect because he backed out. But it's the same thing. Session is private, unable to connect. We just can't get that through the party on Xbox. So once that happens, you should spawn back out here. These steps are very important as the car giver. You must do this. So friend one, car giver, you must do all these steps exactly, okay? Now just kill yourself. Once you've killed yourself, it kind of unglitches you in a way, all right? But you still won't be able to go into bunkers or anything because you will be introduced with another infinite loading screen. The way to bypass that, before you go into your bunker again, pull down on the D-pad, select the story mode character, get the alert, 
hit B on the alert to deny it. And then once you've denied it, you can go ahead and walk into your bunker and you can actually check to see if the car is in there. All right, if the car is in there and it's just like chilling right there, there you go. The car now is in everybody's bunker. We have done the job as the car giver, friend one. So friend two, friend two, you will be getting guns in the bunker. So right now I have the car receiver in a job. Car receiver is still in a job right now. So the way that I do it on Xbox is basically, and look, if you spawn in the MOC, do the story mode trick again. Hold down on the D-pad, select a story mode character, and deny it, go back outside. So I tell the car receiver to spam me a few invites, and then I accept the invites as I'm going into the blue circle of my MOC. And you want to accept them as you're on the black screen. So there we go, I accepted it. I told him to back out of the job right now. I said, go ahead, back out, back out. He backed out, I'm gonna go up to the clouds. I get that alert, no longer available. Just accept these alerts, but you gotta tell your friend to back out of the job on Xbox, it's the only way. And now there you go, I've spawned in the bunker. I have guns, but do not try to take out your guns or anything. And uh, now you wanna get into the car that you're trying to glitch in there. All right, so uh, this car right here, it's a modded vehicle, it's locked, so I'm gonna tell the person giving me this car, set your vehicle access to crew, back out, set it to everyone, and back out, and then I'll be able to get into the car. Guys, if you're doing LG Retro Customs, you want to change the plates on them after you get the car, but you can do this with LG Retro Customs and make money on them. That's why this is also a money glitch as well. So, once we're at that point, now the two friends have helped out, they've done their steps. That's pretty much all they have to do. You know, there's just a few more steps that they gotta do, but those are the, that's pretty much the complicated stuff. Once you've gotten past that, as the car receiver, go outside, through your MOC menu, request personal vehicle. Like I said, you have to have a Fagio or an Elegy in there. So I have a Fagio in mind. I'm just requesting personal vehicle and there is the Fagio, all right? So now that I've gotten the Fagio, I'm gonna go ahead and drive it over there. And the person giving the car, you want them to hop on the back of it or hop in your Elegy with you, basically. So that's BMX right here at this point, all right? He is the person giving me the car, okay? So, car receiver, you know, get your Fagio or Elegy out and go ahead and tell friend one to get on it with you or you can send him an invite to the bunker, okay? So, once friend one has gotten that done, and make sure still nobody is signed in as anything right now, that's really important. So, friend one uh, is gonna be going into the bunker with the car receiver. And we're almost done with the glitch, guys. It's, it's really simple once you get it down. Once you do it a few times, it's super simple. All right, so now he's signing in as a CEO and he's hovering over retire. I'm telling him to do that right now. He says he's good. He's hovering over retire as a CEO. Now I'm gonna go ahead and just hit right on the D-pad right here. And then I'm gonna get frozen behind my MOC. So if you see on the bottom left, that frozen thing, there you go. Now tell friend two with guns in the bunker sitting in the vehicle, that's important. He's over there in that Nero that's being given to me. He is gonna go ahead and throw some stickies down, all right? You're gonna see him actually throw the stickies over there in the corner by the light. So once he throws the stickies, we're frozen already, he can go ahead and blow them up. So there we go, he threw two stickies, I told him to blow them up, he blew them up. Just as simple as that. Now that he blew them up, you tell friend one who's on the back or in the car with you, go ahead and back out of the interaction menu and then get off the bike or get out of the elegy, press pause and go start up a job. So now he's starting up a job right now. That's friend one that was with me helping me get frozen. Friend one is starting up a job. He's gonna go up into the clouds. Any automatic alerts, make sure you decline those. You don't want automatic alerts. Uh, they will not help for this part. So now that he's in a job, I'm gonna go ahead and press pause and I'm gonna go to start, or well, I'm gonna go to pause online, go to players, and I'm gonna go ahead and join him. So I'm gonna go ahead and join BMX right here in a job. He has to stay in this job at all times right now because if not, his car will disappear. So it says the session is private. It's just gonna kick me right back down. Once it kicks you back down, now you're free to get off and now go ahead and hop into the passenger seat with the guy with guns in the bunker, all right? Now I'm telling friend two with guns in the bunker, go ahead and get out of the car. He got out, he's invisible, we can't see him. I slide right over to the driver's seat. Friend one is still in the job. Tell him he must stay in the job or else his car will despawn. So all I gotta do now is go ahead and drive to the corner. And once I drive to the corner, boom, I get sucked in. And that is the glitch, all right? It's really not difficult whatsoever. This is an easier method than the one released earlier this week. That's why I didn't post it or anything like that. But that's pretty much it, guys. Uh, shout out to the founders, uh, Celestial Gaming, Killer Gaming, Gaming with Irish Demons, Cesar909. All their links will be in the description. Uh, but yeah, this is a really, really easy glitch, really fun once you get the hang of it. 
And uh, yeah, just make sure you follow all my steps down to a T. So once as the car receiver, once your car's in your MOC, wait in there for 10, 15 seconds, change some clothing, go into creator so it forces a game save. Once you're in creator, join up a new invite only session. Once you've done that, your car is good. It's saved. You guys are ready to do the glitch again. You invite all your friends back to the new session and then you guys are good. And make sure at this point, if you are doing this as a money glitch and you have an LG Retro Custom from your friend, you need to go change the plates on it, right? Put a custom plate on it and then you are good and free to sell it. But you must put a custom plate on it first, drive out, and then you are free to sell it. All right, so that's going to be it for me. Hope you guys liked the video. Hope you guys learned something. And if you did enjoy it, slap that blue like button. If you did enjoy it. Make sure to subscribe if you're new by hitting the big red button and turn on them post notifications for the freshest and most informative dope GTA 5 online content. Peace out, everybody.